Lights, camera, action. Yo, what's up YouTube? I'm back here with the um, tripod dolly. What I'm gonna be doing today is I'm gonna be just kind of touching up the handle here. I need to kind of clean this down here a little bit. Probably do a little tweaking down there. Uh, maybe clean the wheels up a little bit. I'm not looking for uh, this thing here to be 100% perfect, but I'm looking for it to be at least 90% percent um you know flawless i guess uh what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna start putting on the um the phone the handles that right there is gonna give it you know a little bit of extra cushion and all that so without further ado let's go ahead and let's do it all right so uh here's the phone what i had cut i done this uh last night so i'm just gonna take that do that something like that there so I'm just going to take uh, a little bit of electrical tape that's the only thing I can find right about now to um, keep it in place I would use some hot glue by uh, it's made by Gorilla Glue but it's the hot glue so uh, anyway let's go ahead and Let's taper down a little bit. Not going to use a lot. Alright, so uh, let me get y'all right over here. Here's what we got. Yeah, I know this right here is uh, ghetto, but, you know, it's, it's a DIY. I mean, you know what I'm saying? If y'all hear something in the background, it's uh, just my fan right here. So, uh, yeah, a little warm out here. I'm going to have to um, fix this tape here. But anyway, yeah, yeah there you have it. And I'm going to have to, as I said in part two, I'm going to have to uh, do a little bit of tweaking to this here. I'm going to see how straight this here is. Y'all see that? I got this like this here got the camcorder on there and all that like I say again this right here is gonna need fine-tuning I don't know how good you can see that let me get on the uh, let me get on the other side here right there to the left uh, that there is it's not bent right Look at that right there. I'm holding the, the GoPro uh, pretty much perfectly straight. See what I'm talking about? But other than that right there, I mean, you know, I need to adjust this here a little bit. The nuts and uh, all that. I can hear jokes right now. But yeah, you can uh, pan up, down. You can... Um, do like that get in front and show them how it's um how it's uneven down here get in the front and show them now you can take it and do like that you know and i'm gonna make um uh, some type of rig or something or another where 
where you can mount, say, like a, a GoPro, a light, and all that stuff. All right, so here's what I got. All right. See how I took that and I bent it out real nice. How's that look? I mean, y'all tell me down in the comment section. Finally got this right here all straightened out. Um, yeah, I mean, it's about as straight as I'm going to be able to get it. Uh, yeah, I mean, to me, it looks pretty good. It looks uh, way better than it did before yes this uh arm here it is you know still a little bit tight a little stiff but i'm gonna have to um work on that still all right uh here's what i come up with for now i come up with this right here this right here is a bolt that I had cut. I had cut that right there. And then what I had done, you, you probably can see that uh, Loctite on there. That's permalock. And I do a video on how to do, uh, on how to make these here. We're going to take the camcorder and we're going to go ahead and we're going to mount it on here like this. So there's that right there. All right, so uh, now what I need to do is I need to grab a SD card. Yeah, I don't have a SD card up in here, but yeah, I can go get one. So let me go grab my uh, SD card. Um, I'm gonna just put a 32 gig up in here. That's all I have is 32 gigs. And uh, anyway, we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna do a little bit of uh, test footage and see how this rolling tri tripod um see how it functions all right so this right here would be the panasonic testing footage i guess uh let's go ahead and let's do it I had something on the floor that I had to pick up. Hush Rebel. Yeah, the uh, arm, it's still a little tight and my floor, it's not uh, in that clean of a dish, you know what I'm saying? I mean, it is my workshop, so. Just testing it out here. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's uh, 
it for the test footage or the testing footage so uh anyway we're gonna go ahead and uh we're gonna see what we can do next uh, what i'm trying to do here is i'm trying to loosen this here up just a smidgen or so because i'm trying to get uh I'm trying to get it to articulate uh, more smoother. So yeah, I just have to make the right adjustments and, you know, all that stuff. But anyway, uh, yeah, I'm going to do all that there in part four. I just want to say um, I appreciate y'all hanging out once again with me in my workshop, doing a little bit of wrenching. Never really get as much done as I wanted to as it part four coming soon and that's it so i'm mr white zilla see you in the next video